Hey everyone, I hope you guys are doing well. In today's video, I'm going to be sharing with you five of my top tips and tricks on how I color in coloring pages. For a little bit of context, I've been making coloring pages and coloring books for a little while now, so I've been having a lot of fun creating them. And I've also been coloring in every single one to demo and show you guys exactly how to color them in. Now this brings me to my very first tip, which is coloring the lines. Okay, this one's a little funny and very obvious, but it kind of talks more so about the art supplies that you're using. So when I'm coloring in, I love to use alcohol markers, watercolors, and sometimes color pencils. And you need to remember that you need to not color exactly on the line, giving some wiggle room and space so then the colors or the paint or the alcohol can bleed onto the lines. This trick will actually prevent the colors bleeding past the lines, which you wouldn't really want to have. Now, having said that, the next tip is actually the opposite and it's actually okay to color outside of the lines. You can create your own lines, you can even create little dots, sparkles, shapes on top of the lines with like gel liners, ink or anything and that actually elevates your creation moving away from the coloring outline and creating your own little spice. But do you remember when you're trying to do this? I find the most effective tools are actually gel pens and acrylic pens because they're very very opaque. Now moving on to my third tip and that is to use mixed media. And what mixed media is, is using a whole range of different art supplies to create the artwork. So for an example, I like using either alcohol markers or watercolor to start the base and then I would use another art supply on top to use shading. Honestly, for this trick, you can use any art supplies. Um, when I try to create a gradient effect, I also like using colored pencils because they're very easy to control the intensity and pressure. Now, this also brings me to the next tip, which is to be okay with just using the same art supplies, especially when it comes to art supplies, which you can layer and work intensely into. So what I mean by that is, for example, for alcohol markers, did you know that you can actually just layer the same color, layer above another? And what that does is that the second layer or the third layer and the fourth layer will actually become darker the more layers you add. So what I like to do is for alcohol marker drawings, I will just use the same color as a darker shade. And using the same technique, you can also apply this to create lighter colors. So how that works is you kind of need to plan ahead so as you can see for this drawing for the hair i actually did not color the whole entire thing gray instead i actually just colored some sections and used that gray as the darker bits and what i didn't color in were actually the highlights and now for my final and fifth tip and that is to not care too much and worry too much if you make a mistake i feel like whenever i color i actually make tons and tons of mistakes and sometimes I actually just color on the line and then it bleeds out everywhere. But then what I do afterwards is remember that I can always fix it up with another art supply. I could even just make it look intentional by exaggerating it. So it is always okay to make a little mistake in your coloring because that's what makes it special, right? And you know what? Let's throw in a bonus tip, and that is to always make sure you're having fun. Coloring pages are supposed to be therapeutic, fun, relaxing, and just enjoyable. So remember that you are supposed to be enjoying it and not be super frustrated. So yeah, I hope these tips were super helpful to you. And if you want to get any of my coloring in pages, they are now up on my Etsy. And thank you for watching this video. And if you want to see other videos like these, do let me know in the comments. And I'll see you very soon. Bye! You make me breathe like a bean of heavy smoker. When we get married, we will be ready for what the world will bring. We're burning him if they had buddied up. Lawrence and LaRousse, it was a crew, so much to do. So now we run amok. You laser focus shit from ruthless execution.